I had a rough year. What's been so rough about this year? I've been through the same things you've been through, many of them. What, your son died? No. Well, mine did. What's his name? Jamie. Jamie. So are you performing below what you would have to three oh, years Oh, hell ago? yes. OK, so we got to fix that, don't we? Yeah. So we have to sit down and talk to John tomorrow, OK? I saw rats in the kitchen last night, so I had an exterminator come in here this morning, seal the holes in the walls, and exterminate all the rodents. Now I want to sit down with Jamie and John after what I learned last night and talk about it and make sure the two of them are communicating. I know that this has been hard for you to talk about. I know he wasn't your son, but you think of him too, don't you? Every day. Everybody died a little inside on that. And it made you deal with Jamie differently, didn't it? I think so. I want you guys to start communicating like you used to, John. What is it you need to say to Jamie to help open this up again? Well, all I can say is we just start over now. It's a new day. We work closer. We'll all be on the same page, and that'll help 100%. Look at what you've lost. If you lose each other, too, it'd be over. So I have a hard question to ask you. When does the morning end and your life begin again? You're going to have a brand new business. You're going to have a whole new future. Isn't it time to step up in his memory? Yeah. Rather than shut down in his memory? Yeah. I just, you know, wanted to, to sit there and say we did it, you know, and, and I hope you're peaceful. And tell him what it's time to do. You need to say it, and he needs to hear it. I gotta move on. I gotta move on, Lewis. Oh.